So this is my hedge of hop seed, the hop seed bush. This is what I want to show you guys today. So this right here is in my front yard. This is my front driveway right here. And then right over here is my neighbor's house. So a few years ago, I decided I wanted a hedge between my house and my neighbor's house. But in between or right here where I was going to plant everything, there's no irrigation and I don't have a hose close by to be able to water anything here. So I had to figure out a plant that was gonna require very, very little water and that could take all day sun. So this is getting blasted by the sun all day long. There's no shade at all. So it was not an easy task to find something that um, didn't take lots of water and could stand all day sun. And on top of that, you can see here, if I get down in here, there's concrete here. And then there's a little concrete fence um, right there as well. And it's only like a one foot gap in between. And when I went to start planting these, like it was concrete. I, I couldn't dig with a shovel. So I had to get my landscape friend out here, um, Garrett, and he had a jackhammer. And for every hole we dug, for every, <laughs> every hop seed bush, we had to jackhammer out concrete to plant these. So they can take horrible soil as well. And you can see how awesome they look. It's the beginning of June. They look great, they're growing. They're growing tall, they're nice and green. They're doing just fine. And I honestly cannot remember the last time that I watered this plant. So I would say probably once every two or three months, I pull the hose out and I just flood all these plants. And that is all I do. So hop seed, they will grow tall. Uh, it'll probably get up to 10 feet tall, if not taller. Um, they'll grow wide if you let them, but they're also very easy to trim. They're not gonna take offense to, to being trimmed pretty heavily. Um, I trim them very heavily to stay thin right here between, again, my house and my neighbor's house. They also, once a year, flower like this. You can see these flowers. They're not the greatest looking flowers. Um, but that's about all they do. This is a white variety. There's also a purple variety to where the flowers look a little bit more purple. Um, and that's about as messy as they get. They flower like this, and then you can see there the flowers fall to the ground. Um, but that's about as messy as they get. Other than that, they're an extremely maintenance-free plant. You can see here, these are the young buds that are about to turn into flowers. And then you can see the leaves, they're just kind of nice and nice and slim. They're the perfect desert plant. So if you're looking for an easy shrub, it's not a very fashy showy shrub, just more greenery, but something that can withstand bad soil, something that can take full day sun, and something that doesn't need a lot of water, consider getting the hop seed bush. They're pretty much in any nursery um, in Arizona or the desert Southwest and they grow pretty fast as well. You can see this thing is starting to take off even in horrible soil conditions. So if you're looking for a good shrub, consider the hop seed. Thanks for watching everyone. Let me know if you have any questions. If you haven't already, go out and plant something today. We'll see you in the next video.